So I've been using the HTML button element wrong and in today's video I'm going to be explaining why to you. If you take a look into my screen, you will see that we have a form here and inside of this form we have three buttons. If you take a look at the first button here, because it doesn't have the type attribute, if you click on this button, which is the first one right here, no type, it's actually going to trigger the form on submit function. And in this case, we actually don't want this button to work like this. And because we haven't passed the type attribute, this button every time will act as a submit button. And the second button here, which we actually have the type of button, is actually going to to say okay this button has been clicked we can see now on the alert that this button was only click but didn't trigger the unsubmit function on the form itself and the last button here which actually have the type of submit when we click on it it will trigger the form submission for that particular form why this one is actually working the way it's supposed to work because we actually didn't pass the type attribute to this particular form it makes the functionality of this button unpredictable which is semantically wrong when we are actually working with html so sometimes we actually want to trigger the unclick of that particular button when you have it embedded inside of a form but you mistakenly trigger the form submission it's a bit confusing i know but listening to this video one more time maybe you'll get it i hope you've learned something new today and see you on the next one